What up, guys? Out of <laughs> oh, for, for crying out loud! Jeez. What up, guys? Out of here. Sorry about that. It's it's very cold outside, and my scarf is extremely warm. My best friend made it for me. But anyways, um, so yeah, I've noticed that my <laughs> my video with uh, Markiplier. Um, with his uh, show in Denver has gotten quite a bit of views. Not really surprised. I mean, it's, it's my most viewed video of like 130-ish views or something like that. I don't know. And I'm not really surprised that it's a Markiplier video. That's my most viewed video. I mean, I don't really have a lot of videos otherwise, so I honestly, I really don't have a lot of room to complain. I really don't. So, this is, I, I know that I already posted a video, but you know, in 2018, New Year's Eve, or New Year's Day, whatever. Like, Happy New Year's, Happy 2018. But this is my first official 2018 video that I've technically made. Like, yes, I did a recording of Markiplier's show. I just put a whole bunch of videos together. Sorry I couldn't record more. I wish I could have. I wish I would have, but <laughs> part of me was laughing my ass off way too much. <laughs> Yeah, that was, that, was, that was very funny. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, it's my first official video, and I, I wanted to wait to, a little while to post it because I just went through my first week of school. Like, all my classes, my work, my internship, stuff like that, it's all... The first week is done. And I've already got a crap ton of shit to do. I mean, it's my last semester, and I am a senior, so it, logically it kind of only makes sense. But I'm also taking a forensic science seminar as well as forensic entomology, which is an online class and um, is probably going to be relatively interesting and not too difficult. Um, what else? Pretty sure I said forensic science seminar. That's definitely going to be interesting. Basically, my entire class is full of pretty much forensic science people who are going to be like speci specializing in different things. And we're all going to be processing a crime scene together and then working with law students um, from across the campus, I think. So, And we're going to be, you know, doing courtroom testimony and stuff like that and expert witness testimony. So that's, um, that's going to be, it's going to be really interesting. Um, I have no idea what I'm going to be, well, I mean, I kind of know what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be the fingerprint person for my team. Um... It's it's gonna be interesting to see how that goes. I honestly, I honestly am not sure. This is something new that I've never really experienced before, that I've never really done before. So yeah, there's that. And then of course I'm also doing some research with my pollen analysis and forensic taphonomy professor. But apparently it's one of those things where revol where it kind of works with my schedule. But it's up to my professor to determine when I get to come in, and I haven't heard back from him, so I'm just like, uh, well, what do I do? Also, um, getting it slightly personal now, just slightly, um, it's not gonna be that long. Um, I'm saying um a lot, I need to stop. Maybe I should start thinking about, like, rehearsing for these things. No, it's gonna take too long. But anyways, it happened a few weeks ago, but... At the moment, I am, I'm now single. My, my boyfriend and I were together for about two and a half years. It was going relatively well, but um, I won't, I won't exactly get too detailed into that. That's, that's probably not a good idea. But it just kind of went up and down, and problems were never really being solved. And I, I don't get stressed very easily. I really don't, but. And I'm, it may seem like I do, but it's just an act, just because it's, it's it's almost fun like that. It's, it sounds weird, but it's kind of fun. But, I don't know. I guess some things we didn't really see eye to eye on, and it was just causing me some stress. And given the fact that this is my last semester, this is where I need to start looking for jobs. I need to start looking all over the country, for goodness sake. It was just putting a little bit of pressure on me that it didn't need to, and I needed to be selfish for once. I needed to take matters into my own hands, and I needed to say, okay, I gotta focus on me. I can't focus on a relationship. And over the course of 
a while or whatever, um, it became kind of clear and evident to me that, clear and evident, whatever, but it became kind of evident to me that I was not ready for a mature relationship. I, I'm just not. And I'm not going to be looking for anybody anytime soon. I'm going to be focusing on me. I, I kind of need to. This, this, this is crunch time. Last semester, I need to start looking for jobs because I don't want to live with my parents. I refuse to live with my parents. And I want to actually make something of myself. I want to make use of the degree that I'm about to get in May. I'm about to graduate with a bachelor's. It's kind of crazy to think about. To, to some extent. Anyways, on a slightly lighter note, um, since it is 2018 and it's basically interesting, it's sort of the transition period where I'm going to be going from student to actual adult who's going to be adulting on her own. <laughs> adulting. It's, that, it's weird that that's actually a phrase now. But since I'm going to be adulting on my own now, um, I thought it would be interesting to change things up a little bit, so... I thought it would be fun, and, I, and I've been thinking about this for a while, too, to thinking about every once in a while, like, singing some songs, and not to say that I'm, like, a really good singer. I'm not a bad singer, but I'm not, like, a fantastic singer. I'm, I even, I know I can get slightly off-key every now and then, like, especially for high notes. I, I'm an alto. I can't hit some of those high notes. I, I can't. I literally cannot. But I love to sing. Very much so. It's a big part of my life. I love music. And I was thinking that every month I could have a different topic, different artist, different category, genre, something like that. And I would just sing random songs every now and then that were randomly chosen. Random, random, go hand in hand, obviously. And I probably should have started this, you know, it's almost the middle of the month. I should have started this a while back, but I just wanted to get a feel for the semester and you know actually get a, get back home and away from my family because otherwise I would have had no time to do so because oh I love them dearly I do love them dearly but actually I'll, I'll have that as a rant for another time maybe never but just not now so I've decided that uh, January is going to be Justin Timberlake themed <laughs> Because Justin Timberlake was a huge artist that my sister and I listened to when we were younger. I very much enjoy his music, mostly his older stuff. Um, and I will say that any songs that I sing for this year, in each month is going to be different. But nobody's going to know until that next month. Um, anyways, so yeah, it's going to be Justin Timberlake music. I don't know how many songs I'm going to do. It's probably most likely going to be like... Um, for my drives to and from Seward County, uh, which is a good 30 minute drive. I'm not saying I'm gonna do like five songs in one trip or something like that, but just one every once in a while. And I'm just gonna sing. Now, for the 2018 songs, it's mostly reflective on my style of music, but I'm trying to include a variety of things. I will say this. <laughs> People are gonna call me a little crazy for that. Um, no Michael Jackson. I don't, I don't like his style. I really do not. I know there are many, many people who at least like a few of his songs, but either if it's him or the Jackson 5, I just, it's not my style. It's really not. And Justin Bieber is not either. So, like, no offense, I will never, ever sing a Justin Bieber song. Never. I hate his voice with a burning passion. I also am not a big fan of country or metal. Um, and I'm a bit of a new soul, so most of what I sing is going to be relatively newer. Not super new, necessarily. Um, but like, I feel like most of what I sing is either going to be from, like, between 2000 and 2013-ish, and then maybe some of the stuff in the last five years or so, but otherwise it's, uh, it's, it's going to be relatively new, because I'm not a big fan of the older stuff. I like some older stuff, but not a lot of it. 
So again, this is mostly reflective of my style of music, for the most part. I did get some good tips from my sister, so... And she's the only one who kind of knows all the themes for all the months. I've already decided them. So, this is going to be fun. Wow, that's like 10 minutes. Holy crap. <laughs> I should probably get going. I might need some chemistry things to... Catch. I need to keep looking up here. <laughs> I need some chemistry things to catch up on. Um, it's probably a good idea for me to do that. And I need to eat something. My my stomach is kind of hurting right now because I haven't really eaten a lot in a while. Yeah. So I'm going to leave it at that. That's, that's literally all I'm going to do. I hope I can do some informational videos. I've been meaning to do those, but... Um, uh, the semester's just gonna get a little bit crazy, so we'll see. We'll see how that goes. I'm desperately hoping to get another one up at least this month. That would, that would, I would very much like that if, if I could kick, get my ass in the gear and actually do that, so. Yeah. Okay, now it's time to really be done. I gotta get going. I gotta eat and stuff, and then I gotta hang out with my best friend later. Who made this scarf for me. That is all that I got. That's probably the longest daily life sort of video that I've ever made. Um, so, whatever. As usual, until the next video, guys. Check you laters.